Prince George played a sheep in his school nativity play, the Duke of Cambridge has revealed. While Prince William and Kate spoke to school children, on a visit to BBC's Bridge House in Media City, Salford, on Wednesday, the proud father told how his four-year-old son was involved, in the festive celebrations. Asking the children about their plans for Christmas, George's father said, I went to my boy's nativity play. It was funny. He was a sheep. The young royal stayed at school at Thomas Battersea, in London back in September, where his dad dropped him off for his first day. Aside from acting as a sheep, Prince George has also prepared for Christmas by preparing a wish list, which William vowed to deliver to Santa Claus, during his visit to Finland. In his own handwriting, the adorable prince asked for a police car to be under his tree this Christmas. Kate and William attended a stepping out session, a focus group for children to give feedback, on new programs to children's TV producers and editorial staff. The Duchess, who is expecting their third child, covered her baby bump in a long-sleeved shift red dress. The couple met BBC Director General Tony Hall, chief advisor of BBC Sport Neo Land, and the director of BBC Children's Alice Webb as they arrived at the offices. They then joined children from Friars Primary School, in Salford who had watched a film created by 14-year-old Josh Gale, for news round about developing obsessive-compulsive disorder. In a question-and-answer session with the children, Josh explained he had told his father about his mental health problems. He said, it was metaphorically and physically like a weight off my shoulders. I was wanting to tell someone but I thought no one would understand. William told the children, you're much better than the adults at questions. Very good questions. The couple joined children for group discussions, where they both encouraged the youngsters to talk about mental health. Kate said, people are so worried about what they say, they aren't saying anything at all, and what we've found from speaking to people is it's so good to have conversations. William said, mental health used to be this scary word that people didn't like talking about, and it's slowly getting better now.